my name is Ashley. Um, we live here at JBWS Charleston Homes. Um, this is Menrive D housing. Um, it is for all ranks as long as you have dependents. We currently live in a four bedroom, two bathroom ADA home. Um, and if you aren't quite familiar with ADA, it's handicap accessible. So it's great for those who have wheelchairs or just need those needs. Um, we love this area in general. Um, we've got playgrounds on base. There's a dog park actually like right over there behind the house. Um, we have a school on base. Um, we have an elementary school and a middle school. So if you have kids of all ages, which we have four kids, so they all go here. Um, we also have the commissary. We have the next on base, as well as even a gas station, which always beats the prices out in town, which is nice. And we are conveniently located to the Folly Beach. We've got Charleston downtown, um, Somerville, all of the areas you could want, you know, are right here within driving distance. Welcome to my home. So when you first come in here, you have a nice little entryway area. Um, you can hang coats. We don't use this area too much, um, so it's kind of just like our little cute area. Um, but you could hang coats here. Um, we have an entryway table. It would be nice for like a little bench. And then you have a coat closet. We use it. My husband's sports memorabilia is in here and our games are up there. But it's great if you wanted um, shoes and coats. It would be great in there. And as I said, it is an ADA accessible home. So all the doors are big and the frames are larger than a typical house would be. Um, so it's super, super cozy and big. We love that about it. And then in here you have the first half bath. And this is, um, you have your toilet and then just a standalone sink. And it is so big. Everybody always talks about how awesome it is in here. And again, you can fit a wheelchair perfectly in here if you needed it. You have, this is the filters. Um, and in case you didn't know, um, BB, they provide it. Um, you just call maintenance and they will give you filters and light bulbs as well. Um, and that is a huge plus because you don't have to buy those yourself. And they'll just come and replace them however often you need it. This is our living area. And as you can see, I mean, it's, we have three couches. It's pretty large. And we have, it goes into the dining room. And we have our dining room area. You can easily, again, fit a wheelchair through here. We don't have a wheelchair, but if we needed it, we could fit in here. Perfect. And you have the nice lighting. Um, you know, I love the fact that you have your own little chandelier here over the dining room table, and it's like perfectly setting right there. And you have the natural light from the back door, as well as you have the kitchen window and this window right here, which is our big back porch. Here we go into the kitchen, which is a very spacious, I mean, live-in kitchen. Uh, I love it because you can talk to your family, you can socialize if you have gatherings, as well as your, just your family in general. You don't feel secluded and sectioned off. Um, you get your um, own appliances here that they provide. You get a stove, and when you're in an ADA home, they are actually a different stove than this. Um, you get front knob stove, so if you're in a wheelchair and can't access it, it is perfectly accessible right there. And you have a dishwasher as well over here, and you have a drop down counter height sink for, again, if you are in a wheelchair, and as well as drop down counters that are a little bit lower, as well as cabinets that are also a little bit lower if you have a wheelchair and need to access those cupboards. And then you also get a fridge this is our fridge, but BB does provide fridges and they're great, they're perfect. We just had our own. We have our laundry room, as well as we have our pantry over here, which I will show you. Um, we have our own washer and dryer set, but they do also provide that at an additional fee, which is still greatly affordable. We actually, our old house, we rented it from them and it was a great option if you can't afford your own. Um, we also have a sink here, a utility sink, so it is super convenient for our dogs. We can just give them their water or your mop bucket or anything that you need that for. And then right here behind the door, we have our little pantry and it is perfect for all of our food, whatever we need. 
And as you can see, we can even fit in here our deep freezer because this laundry room is very spacious, as well as we have our shoes here and a coat rack and all of our stuff to hang, you know, hats, coolers, whatever we have. Here you have the garage. As you can see, it is a very spacious garage. We use it as everything. We have toys, woodworking. Um, over here we have the fridge, again, that TV provides. We actually have up here for drinks and snacks that the kids have. And we have this little inlet here that if you needed to store anything, um, as well as you could also still park your car in here with great room. And if you come down here, this is where we start um, heading towards the bedrooms and the other bathrooms. Um, this house, one thing I really love about it is it provides great um, space and closets for organization. And if you have anything that you just need to keep out of the way of you know, entertaining, um, we have right here, this is the first closet. We have um, all of our decor in here and they're huge closets. Um, and then in here we also have another closet which provides tons of space um, to store, again, whatever you need. Um, and then we have spacious hallways again. You can fit a wheelchair down. We go in here to the first bedroom. Um, this is what we use as our spare bedroom. It is, as you can see, there is a king size bed in here. Um, so it is a very spacious room. Um, you have great natural lighting here with the window. And each room has a fan. Um, and the lighting is really great. And again, they come and they'll change light bulbs for free. So it's awesome because with four kids, you're constantly running out of light bulbs. Um, and then each room has a spacious closet. Again, this is another storage closet, so it's not used for regular purposes, but again, I can fit lots of things in there that we need for decorations and other items. And then over here, we have more closets again. Um, these two closets I actually use for my children. These are their clothes as well as their shoes. And again, they each have these um, racks that you can hang clothes on and store items up there as well, which is very convenient because I know a lot of people don't have that opportunity with their own houses. Um, and then as well here, this is my daughter's closet and she has her shoes and her clothes and there's lots of space still left in there if we needed to store anything. We move into the second bedroom, which is um, two of my kids share a room here and we have, this is for space purposes, this is the queen over queen bunk bed. So you can see we still have a great amount of room here as well as we have another fan and here another closet. Again, you're never gonna run out of closets in this house. It is awesome to have all the closets. And they're great space. This one's even bigger than the other room was. We're gonna head back to the second bathroom. This one is the first school bathroom that you're going to see. We have, again, a long hallway right here. This bathroom is huge. Everybody loves this bathroom. Um, again, you have a huge space here to fit a wheelchair, to spin, whatever you need to do in here. Um, the toilet here is actually lower, so if you needed a lower profile toilet, it's awesome. Um, and then you have your double sinks here for him and her, and this huge mirror that my kids love to get messy, and they love it, but then you also have right here a medicine cabinet um, if you needed to store anything in there, and all these great cabinets down here, all this space, and you have all these drawers that are amazing to have. And then you also have a closet, again, and we use this for our linens, and there are lots of shelves in there so you can store everything easily and it is great. I'm gonna walk over here. This is the third bedroom. We use it as our playroom for our kids right now since they do not sleep on their own yet. And it is very spacious. You can easily fit, again, another queen over queen bunk bed or a king size bed in here or twin, whatever you needed to do. We have just a trampoline in here and cubbies and a nugget. So it's very spacious. And again, we have another closet here, which is about the same size as the other ones. So they're a very good size. And then you have again, another fan, which is awesome to have, especially here in South Carolina, it is hot. And then here we move into the master bedroom and it is the biggest room in the house and we love it. Um, you have right here, we have a king size bed as well as a twin size bed. So if you are a family of co-sleepers like us, you will have 
plenty of room to have your beds. And then we move over here and you have great lighting, which I know everybody loves. Great lighting. And we have these two big windows that you can see out. We have a huge back area, so it's nice to see. And then you have room for dressers if you needed multiples. And then you have two him and her closets. This one is mine and it is very spacious. You have tons of room um, if you are a shoe girl or guy, clothes, whatever you need, they will have it for you. And you have also these racks right here. You have three of them, which is perfect to store whatever you need to. And then we are going to go over here into the bathroom. And the bathroom is very spacious. And you have again a him and a her sink. This one right here, actually, you can pull a wheelchair up to it if you need it. Um, and you have all this space in here. This is, I think, the biggest bathroom in the house. Um, you have another closet here. Um, this one has just some shelves in it, and you can store and have your towels in there. And then you have, again, nice lighting. And then this is the shower. The one thing that's really nice about this shower that we haven't needed, per se, because of my son, we're in this house four, and he's three, so he doesn't need the seating capabilities, but if you need it, we, there is a seat provided that we actually have stored in the closet that if you were handicapped and you needed to transfer from your wheelchair into the shower, you're able to sit. And so that is a very nice thing if you were in a wheelchair. And then you come out here to the spacious backyard. We have a great big back porch for entertaining purposes. Um, and then you have a huge back area here. Um, thankfully, we have this. The kids love playing sports back here. They're always out with the neighborhood kids. And it always provides the opportunity to just meet new people um, living out here on base. It's great. I mean, you, as, as you can see, we have plenty of space to ourselves, but also, you know, you can say hi to the neighbors and play with the neighbors. All the kids get out here and they'll play kickball and baseball and all kinds of stuff and it's it's great to just hang out out here.